while many plants contain antioxidants, Dr. McClatchy says that Moringa is also high in the nutrients we usually associate with meat. Moringa is well known for being a, a good source of leafy green vegetable protein. And uh, you, you don't get a lot of protein out of uh, many vegetable foods other than like beans and things like that. So uh, getting it out of the leaves is really a big deal. And while there are a few other plants like soy that are protein rich, Olson says Moringa is special. I have a lot of food allergies. I'm allergic to wheat, I'm allergic to eggs. Soy tends to be a fairly highly allergenic food. It causes allergies easily in many people. Uh, we think that this is because of the, the form that some of the, the proteins are in in soy. Uh, they're apparently in a form that's very simple and fairly easy for the body to assimilate in Moringa. According to the United States Department of Agriculture, Moringa contains 18 of the 20 amino acids, building blocks of proteins that are found in the human body. And says Marcou, Moringa is one of the few plants that contains all of the essential amino acids. Moringa contains all the nine essential amino acids that actually we cannot produce. Um, their presence, but also their ratio, is very beneficial. And um, it is estimated that this ratio is very good for absorption and for being bioavailable to our bodies. 